Well, we're back again, and this time we have a, another artist, but of a, a type of art that is really popular today. He, he's going to talk about that for us. His name is Frank Bonilla. Hi, glad Hi. to meet you. Hi, glad to meet you, too. I'm glad you came in. All right, thank you. Yeah. Thanks for reminding me. Um, well, unlike our two previous guests, uh -huh. I'm older, and I can't draw like they can. <laughs> uh, it started when I was in high school. I decided to take art classes, and uh, everybody else had this talent just like they do. They draw on all these beautiful faces mm. and um, landscapes. I said, man, I can't do that. I, can't I, I have zero <laughs> talent for that. So that began my uh, heading towards abstract because I knew, well, I can say it's this and that and, um, you know, use bright colors. And I went on to uh, West Hills College in Colleen and did the same thing. Mm. It, Everybody else is doing all these beautiful drawings and paints. <laughs> Again, I'm lost. I just resorted to, uh, you know, abstract. So then uh, I was always into photography and art, and but it wasn't until uh, roughly 10 years ago when computers came out that I started uh, playing with digital art. I could take any picture, and I've never used Photoshop or any fancy program. This is just a standard editing program mm -hmm. that anybody can... Uh, buy for a hundred bucks hmm. and I just started playing with it and I said wow I can uh, say upload it to a site like Flickr and my art's there pretty soon I had 50 100 200 300 thousand uh, well there's one there oh my god matter of oh, fact there's this one here that is so beautiful I wish that you could see it in person but it is beautiful uh. um, I can make a hundred variations of this one in one day if I wanted to. Oh my gosh! Um, but anyway, my uh, did my art is digital, so there is other than a few that I've made. Uh, it's only out on the internet. There's an, uh, another image that I just did the other day. Hmm. Uh, but my art has been noticed on the internet. There's a, a company called Kalisher.com. They contacted me. They want to use one of my images for a. Uh, hotel in Oklahoma. Hey. They gave me $800 just for one little JPEG file. Oh my gosh. But I mean the money wasn't in the uh, the important part. They used my uh, image for 192 rooms, the entire wall of the uh, Renaissance Oklahoma City Hotel in Oklahoma. So Oh my gosh. I thought man that's, you know, that's pretty cool. Uh, you know, that's not everybody gets that. It's wonderful. It's wonderful. And then just recently uh there's magazine computer.org slash CGA, mm -hmm. which is the IEEE -E -E Society. It's more or less scientists from around the world. Mm -hmm. uh, a guy contacted me, and my art's going to be next month's uh, cover photo and then an article and an interview on the, uh, on the inside. So <laughs> I feel, you know. You're doing yeah, great. Yeah, pretty lucky. Yeah, I think you've yeah, found so your place. Yeah, there's another one that. Uh, oh, look at the colors in there. It's all just uh, <gasps> digital. Beautiful. And then when I do, um, I when I want to show my art, I want to do it like this one. I have mounted on uh, aluminum. I don't know if they can see it, but that's what it it looks like. Oh yes, beautiful. So, uh, and this is just a small one. I can have made up to 50 by 50 inches. You know, a huge <gasps> one. Of course, it costs money to make them. But I was gonna say yeah. it's got to cost some, somewhere yeah. along the line. <laughs> and and this is my logo that. I created myself, but like I said, unlike them, I didn't draw this. It's just I played with it, it's half a figure, and then used a mirror image, and mm -hmm. it came out to that shape. So I said, <laughs> there's my logo. So. But it's your creativity yeah, that yeah. counts, you know. Maybe yeah, there it is now. Yeah. Can oh see yeah, it. there it is. Yeah. <laughs> it almost looks like a lion if you. Yeah, it's supposed to I mean, when it came out. That's what I said it was. So. <laughs> I love things just I come out it. like you you don't know what is going to all of a sudden you see something there that you didn't know was there. Right. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, there my website is on the screen uh frankbonia.tv and you can see uh uh this is my image of the hotel you can see it in the background the, oh. the entire wall uh I titled the image tornado from above and I guess being that it was in Oklahoma it matched the um, you know the cities there it is. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and that's, that's what they use fantastic. for the hotel. Yeah. I can't imagine doing something on a computer. To me, computers are not totally my yeah. friend. <laughs> All I use is the mouse. That's it. That does everything. Just move it back and forth, in and out. And 
<laughs> it's amazing. I'm I'm very I'm very stuck on reality, you know. Right. And I do mostly animals, and of course, not a lot of people want animals in their house, so I don't sell a lot of right. art. <laughs> There's a heart I created. Oh, look at that! Look at that! That's beautiful. A lot, lot of I like uh, the circles, so you'll see a lot of more round. Uh -huh. I like to call it square art, or round art, or <laughs> it's either one. Oh, look at that one. Now, that now is, see this one, you're going to laugh because it looks really creative. Uh -huh. I found a program on the internet that's made for kids. And I said, oh, look, I'll doodle with this. And in a few minutes, I, I made a picture and modified it and saved it. And, it was and, uh, beautiful. The colors are so beautiful. In there. Yeah, and that, oh. that's what I, I specialize in bright colors. So once in a while, I, I do like black and white too, but the majority of my work is uh, bright colors. Well, it's just fantastic. And there's a serious one I took of uh, black and white. It's a uh, Courtright Reservoir up in oh. the Sierras. So I do take, you know, occasional regular picture. Mm -hmm. Great. Oh, wow. Yeah, and it's all, like I said, just I'll have an image. I can move it with the uh, mouse. I can curl it or twirl it or uh, mirror image, whatever. There's a hundred different things I can do with it. But yeah. the thing is... To know when to stop. Right, right, right. Yeah. And that's that's where the art yeah. comes in. You got to know when to stop too. And with this type of art, I'm so glad that you came in and brought these pictures because it's just been great to have you. Listen, if you're doing any shows or anything, come in. Come I will. When so I get one going here soon, I'll, I'll let you know. I'm glad. It's so mad. Right. Thank you Thank so you very much. much. We'll be right back. <laughs> 